Our class is scientifically known as Osteichthys, or more commonly known as bony fish. They are part of the chordata phylum. Bony fish make up 96% of all living fish in our biosphere. They are cold-blooded vertebrates who breathe through gills and use fins for movement. They have general characteristics like skeleton of bones, scales, paired fins, one pair of gill openings, jaws, and paired nostrils. Most bony fish have swim bladders as well. Over 28,000 different bony fish species have been discovered, which is the most amount of species discovered in all vertebrate classes. These fish can be used for food and medicine, such as cooked salmon or the omega-3 they contain, which helps prevent heart attacks and improves good cholesterol overall. Bony fish live in almost every body of water type. They live in tropical water, temperate water, polar seas, and almost every freshwater body. They usually live from 11 kilometers below sea level to about 5 kilometers above sea level. Different species are adapted for different habitats such as rocky shores, coral reefs, kelp forests, rivers and streams, lakes and ponds, under sea ice, the deep sea, fresh, salt, and brackish water. Some species that you may not be aware of are mudskippers. They have adapted to commonly spend time on land in short amount of time. They do this by carrying small amounts of water in their gill cavities, and when this supply begins to evaporate, they return to the mud holes to replenish their water. African lungfish families adapt to be underwater for a longer amount of time by keeping air in their lung for respiration. These fish must have access to the water's surface or they will drown. As you can see here, this is salmon, scientifically known as Samo Solar. This is an Atlantic bluefin tuna, scientifically known as Thunasthenis. This is an ocean sunfish, scientifically known as Mola Mola. This is rainbow trout, scientifically known as Oncaragnus micus. Most bony fish become sexually mature one to five years after birth. They can reproduce sexually and or asexually, it depends on the species. Some bony fish are hermaphrodites, which means they produce both egg and sperm cells. Sequential hermaphrodites are born with one gender and can change sex sometime during their life. Synchronous hermaphrodites have both sperm and egg producing organs at the same time. Self-fertilization is possible in a few species. A few species are unisexual. There is no fusion between the sperm and the eggs, so unisexual species are always and all female. They then can mate with closely related male species. Changes in temperature, sunlight, currents, tides, moon stages, and presence of spawning areas can affect or stimulate reproduction. Some bony fish may spawn many times a year. Many bony fish reproduce once a year until they die, and other bony fish may reproduce only once during their lifetime. External fertilization of the eggs will be made when male and females alike release sperm and eggs into the water, which releases hundreds of thousands of eggs. However, many of them are eaten by other Osteichthys species. And by doing this, the number of bony fish stays consistent and at a safe amount. Some species also have internal fertilization. Osteichthys' diet consists of crustaceans, which are cousins of shrimp, insects, larvae, any dead fish remains, fish eggs, including their own species, and it is to be mentioned that they are not one specific plane since Osteichthys' can be omnivorous, carnivorous, herbivorous, or even detrivorous. This is the ancestral cladogram for Chordata Osteichthys. This process represents the physical evolution of each species from vertebrae with lampreys to jaws with sharks to bony ribs with ray fin fish to chone with lungfish all the way up to fingers and toes with amphibians. Their behavioral tendencies are the following. Many bony fish will produce a sound depending on their feeling and mood. If they are territorial, aggressive, social, or even for reproductive wants, these fish will make a sound that other bony fish will hear and they will come to the sound or even back off. Thank you.